Well, Hawaii's beaches have become playgrounds for millions of visitors and residents, and with more people comes more opala or trash. Yeah, as KITV Force Kristen Concilio reports, a Honolulu couple is making it their Namayapono, or noble cause, to make sure that litter doesn't ruin our island home. Cleaning up the neighborhood one piece of trash at a time. For the past 12 years, Dave and Judy Anderson start their days at their favorite beach park, not just to get some sun, but to do their part to beautify their piece of paradise. It's an absolutely beautiful park. I mean, we love the fact that this is a park for the Ohana, for the locals. After both retiring as commanders in the U.S. Navy, the Andersons moved across from Ala Moana Beach Park in 2004, mainly so they could ride bicycles, run, and surf. But then they noticed rubbish piling up on the sidewalks, and they felt they needed to step up. But it all just started so casually just by picking up a single piece of trash at a time and putting it in the nearest trash can rather than just ignoring it and walking past it. Hey, look at this. And soon they started bringing their own bags and rubbish pickers to clean up the plastic and other junk off the rocks at Magic Island. To see if we could do something to lessen the amount of plastic that goes out to and gets eaten up by the sea life. Ala Moana fisherman Frankie Bessa says their efforts have not been in vain. It is important for the Aina. I would say it was a labor of love, but they like to see a beautiful place. Anybody would like to see a beautiful place. The couple estimates over the years they've kept about 40 tons of trash from polluting the ocean. And they're hoping to inspire others to do the same. It's right. everyone's problem. But if we each picked up our own area, whatever is right around us, then the entire place would become so much cleaner. It's, it just would be a nicer place to live. Kristen Concilio, KITV4 Island News.